On the 19th of April 1945, the first Belarusian front under Marshal Georgi Zhukov broke through the German line situated about 70 kilometers east from Berlin. German troops were forced to withdraw. Some units moved southwestward into the area of Holborn Markish Buchholz, between the positions of the first Belarusian front and the first Ukrainian front under Marshal Ivan Konev, both of which had pushed forward to the edge of Berlin. As of the 22nd of April 1945, the German forces were entirely encircled and were operating within a shifting and ever more constricted pocket, which moved toward Holber. The surrounded forces included the high command of the German 9th Army led by General Theodor Busser. With them were thousands of refugees, local civilians and military dependents. The number of soldiers in the pocket is estimated at between 150,000 and 200,000. Busser gave the order to break out of the pocket. The goal was to reach the positions of the 12th Army under General Walter Wenck, and then jointly move to the west bank of the Elbe. On the 24th of April 1945, the first attempt at a breakout was made at Halber. Several further attempts followed. Bitter fighting ensued in and round Halber. The effect of the Soviet fire, supported by massive air attacks, was devastating. The German troops suffered very heavy losses. More than 40,000 men died in the Halber pocket. Some 25,000 German soldiers managed to break through to the Elbe, where they surrendered to the American troops.